everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is Face Mask Friday. So tonight's video is, or face mask, should I say, is this one. I received this in my box swap from the lovely Kimberly Annan. I will leave a link in the description bar to Kimberly's channel. And I've never tried this before. So this is by Global Beauty Care Premium. It says retinol spa treatment mask, anti-aging serum, smoothing, 15 minute facial therapy, minimises the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, delays effects of skin ageing, definitely need that, oh I have such a headache people, I've just took tablets and sorry if you can hear my washing machine. <laughs> so yes, one facial treatment, let's have a look. Global Beauty Care Retinol Spa Treatment Mask is an effective facial skincare therapy designed to improve the health and appearance of your skin. Our moisture-rich formula contains retinol to help minimise expression lines and wrinkles. I have a lot of expression lines. Aye. <laughs> Boost cell renewal and delay the effects of skin ageing. Just one treatment will help repair, revitalise and restore your skin to a healthy and young-looking complexion. Well, if it can do all that in one go, it is a bloody miracle. So it says, cleanse face and remove any makeup. Open sachet and remove the pre-moistened mask and unfold position and place the mask on your face. Smooth mask gently with your fingertips to spread evenly over face. Wipe away any excess gel with a cotton pad or tissue. Wear mask for 15 minutes for best results. Make sure to wash off all remaining residue immediately after treatment as leaving on longer can cause an allergic reaction. This is a one-time use product. Please use right after opening. Refrain from using it if you have sensitive skin or are allergic to any ingredients listed in the ingredients panel. Recommended usage once a week. Great. Okay. The ingredients. Well, we'll give it a go and if it feels a bit too much for one skin i'll take it off so i'm guessing it's going to be dripping the product did you see that squirt there got me kitchen timer he loves to make an appearance doesn't really smell of anything dripping in product as usual and it'll look it's dripping like look <laughs> this we've got a towel there put this on my thighs and of course it's going to be cold, but I'm going straight in the shower after I do this. I already have my Percy and Reed hair mask on because it's the best hair mask that I have ever had. And once we do this without ripping the damn thing, we'll slap it on my face. Did anyone else have a hail shower today? Oh my goodness. It is the... Is it the 10th today? I don't know. Tenth of me, I think it is. What is happening here? Seriously. <laughs> oh my god, it's so freaking cold. And I really, really, really mean it is. Oh, let's get this timer started. Because I don't think I can take 15 minutes of this freezingness. Right, come on. What are you doing here? <laughs> It's not sitting very well, is it? Oh. It doesn't smell nice, I'll tell you that much. It really doesn't. Okay, so we've got our timer on. And yeah, let's have a chat. <laughs> yeah, we had a hail shower earlier. Oh, mental. There's going to be a festival here on Sky at the Clan Donald Centre. It's the first one they have ever, ever had. I am not going to it because I think it is a waste of money personally to me because I'm not interested in any of the bands that are going and I would rather spend my money elsewhere but you know there you go so they'll be hoping that it's nice weather for that. <sighs> Don't you love this? Honest to God. What else has been happening? Uh, I, w I have been gaining some subscribers. Yay! So thank you for a new subscriber and hello. This is me. This is me. Oh, let's not quote Great Showman because I wasn't a fan. Um, so currently at the moment, as it stands, and I think it is, I think it is the 10th of May today. Tuesday was the 7th. 8th, 9th, 10th. Yeah, 
It's the 10th of May, but obviously you won't see this on the 10th of May. And currently at the 10th of May, I have 980 subscribers. Yay! Maybe by the end of the weekend, I might be picking one of you lucky people to win my 1,000 subscriber giveaway. Fan Dabby Dabby Wabby Dozy. So yes, all good stuff. It's Friday. I'm going to watch RuPaul's Drag Race because I love it. Still champion Brooklyn. I hope she wins. But you just never know. And what else am I going to watch? I don't really know. I always say, oh, I'm going to sit and put a nice film on and chill and relax. Julie, you never relax. Um, I want to finish my book. I am on the very last chapter of it. It is called The Guilty One or The Guilty. It's okay. It's not the best book I've ever read, not the worst book I've ever read. So I'll hopefully get that finished tonight and then we'll get on to another one. God, my life is exciting, is it not? I mean, I bet you are just chanting that about to come and join me. Excuse me. Uh, hopefully this headache will disappear. Got my washing on. Woohoo! <sighs> That's about the excitement of life. I'm just, I don't know, I'm just... It's been a quick week, actually. I only work Tuesdays to Fridays, thank goodness. If I could work even less and afford to, I certainly would. And if I could afford to not work at all, then I wouldn't, but... Hey, that's the dream, isn't it? But that's exactly what it is, just a dream. Eh, uh, what else to tell you? What else to tell you? I put an order into Colourpop. I finally was like, I'm going to do it. So that'll be coming at some point whenever it arrives. And I will... This mask is annoying. I will show you what I got. I look like a demented sort of bird. Look at the way it's bundled on my nose. I better look bloody a million years younger after this because it is <laughs> not attractive. Suck it in that nose. <laughs> oh. Oh my good god. Yes. So I don't think there's anything else to tell you, really. I've just sort of been... Ugh. Like, why? Like, if I do this, it goes into my mouth. Or stay down there, then. Um, I'm going to watch... I watched last year a, a Colleen Nolan and a few other celebrities or famous women a, got together and... In one way or another, they have a story based around cancer or breast cancer and they do like the full Monty, but they don't reveal everything, they just get their jugs out. And I enjoyed watching it last year because it's something that's very close to my heart because I lost my mum. She had breast cancer in both her breasts and then she got cancer in her liver and she passed away in 2003 when she was 53. So I enjoyed watching it, it's very emotional and that it was on the telly the other night and I totally missed it because I don't actually watch a lot of telly so it just happened to come up on like Facebook or somewhere. I think it might have actually been Instagram on Daniel Ar Armstrong from Tiwi's page because she's in it because her best friend died of breast cancer. So I'm going to watch that on the Ace TV player. Um, just, I don't know, look, this is slipping off my face. I'm really not liking this mask. <laughs> it's a disaster. Please hurry up, timer. Because this is not worth it. It's a little bit, it's not irritating, but I can feel it tingling a little bit. It's almost like as if we needles are just gonna like. T -t -t -t. I like to party, everybody does. We can pray for the weekend of love. To see what you get up to, get up to. Do, 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 do. Absolute maniac. Uh, YouTubers I've been loving and you should totally check out are the lovely Laura Bollum. I'm going to leave a link to her. The lovely Lisa Subscription Box. I'm going to leave a link to her. They deserve way more subscribers than they have. So I would really appreciate it if when you are here and you're liking and subscribing to my channel and clicking the bell and entering the thousand subscriber giveaway that you would also go to Lisa's channel and go to 
Laura's channel and also go to Sincerely LGS's channel too. Subscribe to all three of them, tell them I sent you, show them the love and I, their links will be in the description bar because they're three brilliant, brilliant, brilliant ladies. Um, Sincerely LGS, Lisa, hi if you're watching. Uh, she's a beautiful Canadian, but she's so stunning. Like, she's just stunning. And she's always, like, glowing. And her personality is just, oh, she's so nice. Laura Bollum, she is a lovely lady as well. Very down to earth. Does a lot of unboxings, makeup videos. She's the mother of five. Five kids. That's mental. Good on her. And a uh, Lisa subscription box as well. As it says in the name, she's obsessed with subscription boxes. So if that's your bag then you should be heading on over to her channel. Right, guys, I'm afraid I'm going to have to get this off. It was just coming up to the five-minute five, five minute mark, but, right, I'm going to wash this off my face. Ah, uh, it's actually irritating. Like, I can feel it. So let's just pop that here on the table, take you guys with me to the bathroom. Oh, <laughs> if I can get up, and we'll get it rinsed off my chops. And I'm not so sure... It's going to make me like 10 years younger. It was quite a bold statement, wasn't it? To say, oh, break the place. It was quite a bold statement for it to say that it had all these sort of properties or whatever. But let's get this little mix from Elemis head up before I take this off. Wash it all off. Just give it another rewash. Me and my friend Callum were just talking there when he gave me a lift home. Like, bearing in mind, I'm 35, Callum's what, 21, 22? And he's like, Oh, I love a Friday night when you're in your tucked up in your bed at 10 o'clock. I was like, Oh my god. I was like, I'm the old lady. And he was like, I know. He's like, but see, after a week of work. <laughs> oh, so funny. So funny. Right. Just dry my face with this towel. And let's have a wee look at what we think. So, my face feels plump. And smooth. Really smooth. I don't know if that's what it was supposed to do. I think it was. Um... So this is my skin, as you can see. Definitely the lines haven't gone because it's not going to do that in one go. Now, while we're here, what do you think to my blackheads? Can you see them? Do I feel that that, by the time you see this video, you'll have seen my review of the pore cleanser, eh, the pore vacuum remover. Now, I think it has made them reduced as in they're not as focus they're not as predominant you can still see them but they're not as black and predominant but what i didn't i don't get about the poor vacuum clean vacuum keeps in vacuum clear the poor vacuum is that i wanted to actually see the black gunk coming out like you would if you were using a pore strip and it just, it just doesn't do that. Or it doesn't do that for me. So that's why. And talking of that poor vacuum, after I did my review on Amazon, which is where the company sent it to me, they were like, oh, can you go on and change, change your review and give us more stars? And you know that way I was like saying to my work colleague, you know, I'm not going to lie. I am not saying don't buy this, it's shit. I was basically being honest and saying that I was going to go on to wish myself and I was going to get one of these poor vacuums to give it a go and see if it worked because I've always had loads of blackheads, always. I can't get rid of them. My partner uses the pore strips, he takes it off, he's got loads of gunk and crap on the other side of it and mine just doesn't seem to. Now, I clearly do have blackheads, so why is nothing coming out of them? So it's a bit frustrating. And when they contacted me, this company, and said, would you like to review it? I was like, of course, right? Now, it was it's $19.99 on Amazon. Great value. The machine itself, I am just talking for me. 
it hasn't done what I wanted it to do or what it claims to do for me. Yes, it has minimised the blackheads, but it hasn't removed them. And they were saying to me when they emailed me after I did my review, oh, but, you know, maybe you're not losing it right and whatever. And I'm thinking, hold on a minute. I'm following the instructions that you provided. And I have you know, steamed my face and put the cloth on after the shower or what have you, used it. And I've used it, since I did the review, I've used it at least five times. I might even use it again when I get out of the shower. And as I say, when I look in the mirror, to me, you can see where the blackheads are and you can see that they are reduced. But still, there is nothing sucking out like the vacuum's supposed to do and going into the little pads. And that for me is why I am just like, I'm not gonna give it five stars. You know what I mean? And I think that's fair enough. If you're gonna send something to a YouTuber, an Instagrammer, a blogger, don't ask them to lie. Because what's the point? What's the point in me saying to you guys, oh, it's brilliant, your blackheads will be gone, it's amazing, all this gunk comes out. Then you go and buy it, say, oh, I bought this because Julie Barber suggested it's great, good value for money, and it does so dull. So I, I was just like, no, I'm not going to change my review on it. You wanted my honest opinion, I haven't been paid to say, and even if I had been paid, if they had paid me even a thousand pounds to say my product was amazing, if the product isn't amazing, I'm not going to, I am not going to lie for you. So, anywho. So yeah, that mask was okay. I don't think I'd personally buy it again just because I didn't like that tingly feeling and I couldn't keep it on any longer than 10 minutes and it's to be on for 15. But, you know, my skin does look okay. I think it looks pretty good actually, but... Yes, so thank you Kimberly for sending me that mask to try, it's always good to try them and yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, don't forget to go down into the dubs description, the description bar, the description bar and subscribe to all of these ladies channels that I've left and I'll leave Kimberly's as well since she's because she sent me the mask and I'm very grateful and enter the thousand subscriber giveaway, if you come over to my channel and you're new and I've hit a thousand then you're truly an entering, but never say never. Come over, subscribe, like, and there'll be more giveaways to come even later down the line. But let's get to that thousand. Thanks so much for your support, and I will speak to you very soon.